Good morning! So this weekend I am heading out to the desert. Um, I will be going to a little town called Pahrump, Nevada and they're having a hot air balloon festival. And I'm really going because they're having a light show and it's where the balloons light up timed to music. So I'm really excited about this adventure. I'm really excited to share it with you guys and share the photos that come out of it. I have got my coffee ready. Coffee is life. It's about a six hour drive from here and yeah, I'm just excited to share it with you guys so stay tuned. So this is where the balloon lights are going to happen. It's a balloon show. It'll be timed to music and they're all getting set up right now. I think I got a pretty good spot. All right, we got about 20 minutes until the light show. They're starting to get in the air. Nevada Hot Air Balloon Festival. It is a happening place. We got about five minutes. One more balloon is going up, and then we will be getting some cool pictures and a pretty light show. So they're going to be starting the light show here in just a little bit. I wanted to share with you my settings. Right now I'm at one second shutter speed, my aperture is 4.0, and I have my ISO set at 50. I am planning on making a 10 second exposure, but I think it's going to make it blurry because they're hot air balloons and they move around. I'm going to try it out and see what happens, um, but I think one second is pretty safe right now. One. Better flight. during the show um, as the lights were flickering and just trying to figure out what was right. I will share my settings with you with the picture that I decided that I liked. I took quite a few different pictures, um, but that was it. They're all coming down. Hey guys. 
guys, so I am back at the cabin, um, went to the Pahrump Balloon Festival, so here in Pahrump, Nevada, and um, it was such a cute little festival. They had um, a Ferris wheel going, they had hot air balloon rides, which you could buy a ticket to go up in a hot air balloon, which was pretty cool, and then also they had a bunch of different vendors and things that you could shop around at, so it was pretty neat, and then at six o'clock they had or it was actually six thirty they had um the light show so that was really what I was there for I wanted to be able to get pictures of that um light show and all those big hot air balloons all up together all at once so anyways that was my main goal was to get that and just being able to cruise the festival was a lot of fun but anyways so um the getting my settings correct was a little bit difficult for me as I knew it would be because of it being a light show. So one balloon lit up and then another one went dark and then another balloon went up and then another one went dark. And so really that made it very hard for me to as far as what I needed my settings to be. Um, especially when the fire came up, it created a big hot spot for um, the camera and you know it was very bright with um, completely dark all around so I played a little bit with it I tried um, to uh, change my settings quite a bit just to see what would work best I had a few things in mind that I didn't want to do I didn't want to bump my ISO because I didn't want to have a grainy picture and then I also did not want to have too slow of a shutter speed just because it was um, they're hot air balloons, so they're going to be moving around. And so I tried going down to 10 seconds. I also had one second shutter speed. And so just trying, you know, back and forth with that. But that was really my goal. I wanted to have a few balloons lit up at once and then um, be able to get that shot. So I had to have my shutter speed a little bit low. But it was tricky because I didn't want it too low for when the balloon swayed and it created a blurry shot. So anyways, I'm really excited to share those with you guys. Um, this trip has been a lot of fun. If you guys like this video, give it a big ol' thumbs up. You know, it really helps my channel. And then um, leave me a comment. I would love to talk to you guys about... Um, just my photography and everything. If you guys have any questions about my settings, about the festival, um, where I am, that would be great. I would love to chat with you guys. I do read all your comments and I try to respond to all of them. So anyways, leave a comment. I will be um, leaving all my camera gear, everything that I use today in the description below this video, along with my blog post. So if you guys want to know a little bit more about how I traveled here, what roads I took, about the balloon festival, or what that's all about, um, click on that blog post and go and read a little bit about it. So, um, anyways, that's going to be in the description below. And then also, if you guys want to get a um, heads up of when I post something, click that subscribe button. So there's a red subscribe button down below. Um, if you guys want to just see when I post something new. And for you guys that has to subscribed. Thank you. I appreciate it. It does really help my channel. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.